Okay, good evening everybody. Um, I just wanted to give you a bit of an insight into the course planner for this week. Um, we've got two course planners. We've got my course planner and we've got Paul's course planner and I just wanted to show you what, what is kind of going on. Um, I want to try and make this as interesting as possible for you because I know looking at course plans can be quite boring. So uh, we're going to have a little look inside the course planners. The, this one here is a chart that I get um, which is like a, we, we work out what the wind chart is so um, you can see the map of the golf course and we'll basically put a line through here to sort of show what the wind is going to be so when we get onto the tees we can see which way the particular wind is going so this being the first hole uh, you can see the wind coming possibly down and off the left slightly and um, this is something that you guys could probably do at home as well if you get your um, your charts for, for your own golf course so just draw a line straight across for the day which indicates the wind so that's my sort of wind chart then we move on to my yardage book um, so this is this is slightly different to what you guys would see um, in your own um, your own home grown should we say your home um, golf courses um, you can see here that I've done sort of we've had a couple of practice days already and I've done some yardages of Paul's second shots um, and obviously what golf clubs he's used off the tees on par fours and par fives so I keep a note on what's going on there you can see all these different yardage points which are to, which indicate my sort of what what distance we've got off the tee so off the first tee we've got 250, 252 here which leads me to the front of that bunker um, and then obviously second shots in and then I've got a little bit of a plan on what's happening um, on the greens so I've got my sort of um, lines here which indicate the sloping of the greens then we'll look at um, then we'll look at I've got here a, a chart also which shows me what Paul's yardages are so this is what his carry yardages are and this is generally what his run out run outs are for these particular ones uh, right the way through the bag if I look at Paul's Paul's got his own here um, this is Paul's notes himself so he's got his own yardages just these he knows his own yardages but these are just things that he can just under pressure he can sort of clarify exactly what he's doing but what I really really wanted to show you because this chart is identical to mine to a degree but then further on <clears throat> we've got these numbers here which you can see which is um, now this is for people who use Aimpoint, and Paul uses Aimpoint, and I'm not going to go into Aimpoint, but you can look it up on YouTube. But these are um, these are sloping percentages that we've got here, right the way, the, right the way around the green. Now um, it may look really, really complicated, but for people that know how to use Aimpoint, you'll you'll see that this is actually um, a really, really good sort of feel as to how this is working. So Paul will know exactly what his percentages are. Um, when he's hitting a putt so I mean right the way down to the fact that I don't even have to look at the actual green I don't have to get down and look at it we can literally look on this planner figure out what his percentage is use his fingers to indicate what what percentage it's going to be and then aim to that point and then hit the putt and as long as he gets his his um, his speed correct it should move pretty much on those numbers that you're seeing there so I just wanted to give you an insight into that because it's really quite it's quite interesting um, it's quite scary if you don't know what you're doing with it but um, it's it's absolutely phenomenal and I think the European Tour are potentially looking to ban this but uh, I just wanted you to see exactly what is going on in our yardage charts for this week so um, game on tomorrow morning look forward to seeing you out on the course